Hello guys and welcome back. So in the last section we saw how we can add and read uh, data from Firebase database, uh, real-time database. And now in this section we are going to talk about updation and deletion. Now let's first uh, quickly go to our new user components template and add a button here uh, to update some data. Let's create that button here with the type of uh, button and I'll name this update uh, user and I'm going to define a method on this one when the user clicks on it which is now going to be called update user like so I'll copy the name here and add it to the TypeScript class and I'm going to call a method on the user service update a user on database is going to be the name and let's uh, pass the data from this user service that we have the first object that we had inside the user list let's also update the name of this to let's say um, user form dot uh, value dot name but i don't really have user form so i'll have to pass that as an argument which is again going to be of type ng form and in the user form i'll be passing from here as well like so let's save this go back to the template here and uh, this is going to call the update a user on firebase method uh, wherein i have updated the name uh, let's save this now and uh, go back to the ui so i have an update user method here um, let's first fetch the users so these are the two users that we have this is the first one and this is the second one let's add a name like uh, jacob Riglin here and click on update user i'm going to update this user here so the john the name john doe should now be updated to um, jacob Riglin. but i get an error message saying that it cannot read the property set of undefined uh, which means that there is some issue so i'm gonna open the user service and uh, it says that it cannot set the property of undefined which might be an issue here oh so the thing is that instead of uh, doing this i have to set a name on it let's save this now go back Let's fetch the users first and now let's click on update and now it says that reference update failed the first argument contains an invalid key in the path um, which it is saying because the update and uh, the update method and the create method uh, that the firebase's real time database um, exposes uh, doesn't really take a dollar key inside it as an argument for an object so we receive the user here with a dollar key but then we'll have to delete that key from the from the user object and without that it's not going to work so we deleted the key here uh, using this delete keyword let's save this now and check if it works so i'll just quickly get the users and i have two users right now the name is still john doe uh, let's type the name to uh, change the name to jacob riglin again and i'm gonna click on update user and i didn't get any error which means that the name is updated now to jacob riglin so far so good now the final thing is going to be to delete a particular user so i'm just going to copy this 
uh, button here and instead of update i'm going to click uh, say delete user and uh, the name is going to be delete user for the, for this one as well i don't really need a user form here and let's copy this mess uh, this method name here uh, from here and paste it here like so and i'm just going to call the user service dot delete a user from firebase and i'm gonna give it the user list of one dot dollar key all right let's save and go back let's again fetch some users so we right now have two users here and now i'm going to click on the delete user button and i now just have one user here inside this list and once if i go back to the database i only see just one user here from on the database as well okay so this is how you can uh, basically perform crud operations on a real time database inside firebase so that was it regarding this uh, section of this uh, part 7 series uh, on angular training in the next series that is going to be the part 8 or the section 8 of the series we are going to talk about unit testing and uh, several other types of testing there are in an angular application so i'll see you guys in the next video bye